Okay, so this is our problem number 3 for the block shear strength. Compute the block shear design and allowable strength of the tension member shown in the figure. The bolts are 16 mm diameter bolts and 836 steel is used. So, ganun pa rin, kagaya lang din naman to ng ating problem number 2. Kaso dito kasi, ano siya, um, plate. Okay, so dito, angle bar. So, ibig sabihin, ang failure path na lamang ito ay dalawa. Okay? So, isa rito. And, so, this is failure path A and this is failure path B. Okay? So, hindi, hindi naman pwede rito lang. Okay? Then, hindi naman malayo rito kasi mahaba pa yung pagpupunitan nito, di ba? Doon sa isang leg. Kaya hindi rin pa pwede dyan. Kaya ito lamang yung dalawang type of failure natin. Okay? So, at a Okay, so A and B is equivalent to Ilan ba to? 70, 70 and 35 So, 175 Then, ilang butas? Okay, dalawat kalahati ulit So, 2.5 multiplied by 16 millimeters, no? So, yung ating effective Full diameter is 20 millimeter diameter So, ilan to? Uh, 2.5 multiplied by 20 then, multiplied by, okay, uh, yung thickness ng ating uh, angle bar, which is 13. Okay? Okay, so, ilan to? 175 na, so, kumpitin kumpiti natin. So, 175 minus 2.5 of 20. Then, multiplied by, okay, multiplied by 13. Then, multiplied by 2. O nga pala, multiplied by 2 kasi dalawa yung Ano natin, na sure dyan. Okay? So, 3 to 50. Multiplied by 2. So, yung ating A and B is equivalent to 3 to 50 millimeter squared. So, ngayon, masasob na natin ng AGV. So, 175 multiplied by 13 multiplied by 2. 175 times 13 times 2. So, uh, 4550. So, kaparehas lang to actually ng ating problem number 2 eh. Okay? Ayan, parehas na, parehas lang siya. Oh, sorry. So, this is FU, A and V, and 0.60 of FY, AGV. So, competent pa rin natin para uh, do uh, um, double check natin sa problem number 2 kung tama talaga na solve natin doon. So, 0.60 of FU, so 400, multiplied by A and B. So, 3 to 50. Then, over 1,000. So, 780 talaga siya. Kilo, Newton. Then, isa naman, 0.60 of FY, 248 of AGV. AGV is um, 4, 4, uh, 4550. Then, divided by 1,000. So, this is 6. Okay, sorry. Okay, na sobrahan. Ay, 0.6. Okay, then divided by 1,000. So, 677.04 kN. So, itulit yung gagamitin natin para sa shear. Okay? Then, para naman sa ANT, this is 55. Then, minus uh, dalawang tig kalahati ng diameter. So, isang diameter na yan. So, 20 multiplied by 13. So, 55 minus, okay, 20 multiplied by 13. So, 455 millimeter squared. Kaya yung ating P N sub A is equivalent to uh, 677.04 plus 400 multiplied by UPS na 1.0 multiplied by 455 over 1000. Okay? So, 677.04 six, uh, six, plus 400 multiplied by 455 over 1,000. So, 859.04 kilo newton. Okay? Oops. Yeah. Next. 
at B. So, ito yung B natin, no? So, kalahatiin lang natin yung AN, ano natin? ANV. So, 3, 2, 50 over 2. And kalahatiin lang din natin yung AGV na 45, 50 over 2. So, 3, 2, 50 over 2. 1625 millimeter squared and ganun rin yung uh, AGV natin so 2275 so ibig sabihin kakalahatiin lang din natin yung para sa shear natin so yung 0.60F y AGV na lang kasi dun na, yun yung naman yung nag-govern kanina okay so 677.04 divided by 2 so 338.58 ah uh, 52 millimeter square. Then, let's solve A and T. So, buo na to, no? So, 55 plus 20. So, 75 minus ilang ano, butas. So, isa't kalahate. So, 1.5 of 20 multiplied by 13. So, ito yung ating A and T. So, 75 minus 1.5 of 20 multiplied by 13. So, 585 millimeter squared. So, masolve na natin yung ating P sub, uh, yung PN sub B, which is equivalent to 338.52 plus 400 multiplied by 1.0 multiplied by 585 over 1000. So, sa, ano kaya mag-fill dito? 338 plus 0.52 Okay, ah, sorry, 338.52 plus 400 multiplied by 1.0 multiplied by 585 over 1,000 So, 572.52 So, ito pa rin yung ano, no? Okay, so kilo newton. So dito pa rin yung mas mabilis na uh, fill your pot natin. Yan. So ibig sabihin, yung ating design strength is 572.52 multiplied by 0.75. So 429.39. 429.39 kilo newton and pn over um, omega so 572.52 over 2.0 so 286.56 286.56 kilo newton okay diba napaka ano lang napaka dali lang talaga nung ano nya pagsasolve nitong ano black shear mukha lang siyang komplikado kasi syempre marami siyang failure path and Buti din naman sa introduction, mukha siya mahirap, di ba? Pero, patutusin eh, madali lang talaga siya. Okay, ayan. So, uh, ganyan lang kadali yung ating problem number 3. So, this is our problem number 3 for the block shear strength under chapter 3 ng tension members of steel design. So, thank you for watching. Bye!